Hello, I just completed a video and still jam on the way home. So I thought uh, of taping another one using this method. Actually, I set up a few few gadgets in the car to make sure that the taping are done properly, so that you can see uh, the the video uh, without giri. Okay. So this is uh, I'm just doing the adjusting. Okay. Uh, a few, I think one or two months back. I think two months back. Uh, I was uh, a bit lost because this pandemic have caused a lot of uh, mountain. They call it mountain. In Mandarin means a lot of. Uh, I will say it's like uh, dead end, dead end in English. For a lot of travel industry people, a lot of businesses are affected. And uh, some are seeing lights, uh, meaning that it's good. Uh, but then again, majority are still suffering. So I inevitably also affected because the law of attraction is something which is very strong. If you have 10 people around you with such a negative uh, character, no matter how strong you are in the positive, you will always be affected. Uh, a little bit affected so uh, that is one point the other point is also women being women there are times we are a bit um, out of uh, the sin in a sense sin that we, we don't know why we get angry we don't know why we get agitated you know it's not PMS uh, it's not uh, monopause you just felt very bad you felt very sad and you felt you know everything is like very exhausting uh, I, I'm not sure whether anyone feel that way or not for me uh, once or twice a year I will face it then if you search whether people will say maybe you have psychiatric problem well sometimes it's good to be crazy once a while you make life more colorful so during that time, I was searching for something in the internet and then the, uh, one video came out followed by another video and another video which makes me thought about, think about, not thought about, think about uh, uh, those uh, people who are KOLs, you know, uh, Wang Hong, they call Actually, this kind of uh, professional uh, Wang Hong or KOL, they are really very, very professional. They really spend a lot of uh, pain, thoughts, time, sacrifice. I remember once. Uh, Three years ago, I was handling a hotel and um, marketing and we hosted the KOLs for a trip overseas and um, it was uh, winter. But these young KOLs are so professional that you feel ashamed that small little thing that uh, certain of your staff complain makes it like you know makes you wonder actually they are working or they think we owe them something you know so this KOL that I mentioned they in the winter take out the clothes so that they can pose better you know, take out the clothes that's not as in naked lah, you know, because they have to show the certain clothes is uh, thin and then uh, you have to show nice weather and winter is always very nice skies and you know, people don't know it's winter unless you see snow but from the outside, it's, it's, just, it's just normal so, uh, what happened was she, she 
took out her I'm sorry ah, it's blipping ah, which is uh, I have to apologize because I'm reversing my car into my house ah, so let me stop ah, because it's interesting so I, I don't want to miss the opportunity of appreciating KOLs she took out everything and she was so cold but she appeared so well on her photos for for the the promotion that you had to salute her young girl young boy do so much taping they they don't only tape once you know they have to tape a few times so that they can get uh, the the good shot and then uh, it was so cold. I so fat also. I had to put a few uh, clothing. She so thin. And then right in the in the winter, uh, even though no snow, but it's really cold. And then when she when I saw her coming up to the bus, of course I tried to warm her up. And her fingers are all blistered and. It's also bleeding, you know. I asked her to wear gloves. She said cannot because I have to finish this tape. From that day on, I tell you, I really, really salute their dedication. So please, if you don't like the KOL, just don't comment anything. Just ignore it and move on. Because they have done all they could, what they know. To make sure that they deliver the best result for their fans or for the public to see. It's not easy. Even for me to tape a video like that, it's not going to be easy if you give me a script or give me a, 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 a topic that I must talk about. That's why you see I sway between uh, life, coaching, travel... Um, a lot, of, a lot of other things because I love what I do, and so I'm blessed with that. I, I, I really hope that I can help somebody. Um, when I can coach someone to uh, see their life, to hold their hand, walk their journey for them, but it's not in me to keep selling, coaching or travel or what. It's just that I feel that it's really wasteful if you waited any time, any longer, just to discover that you are better than what you are. So if you are still interested in coaching, uh, please look for me. You can drop me a comment or you can email to me because uh, too many spam calls, so I don't take calls. Uh, even in the FB, you also have spams. All, all are spams. I mean, excuse me, not all are spam. Those I don't know are spams. Okay, so you can drop me an email. Uh, or you can look for your coach from your network. Go and look for somebody for guidance. You will always feel that you have done the best for yourself when you do that. Uh, what you decide now might look silly, but for a person who have walked through life with so many obstacles, it's worth a try. Okay? See you.